The project is uh, the installation of 11 kilometers of large diameter natural gas line, 36 inch and 42 inch, in the municipalities of Surrey and Coquitlam. Uh, the line runs with an existing utility corridor, so we have a, an existing natural gas line and we're installing a, a second uh, line or a backup line uh, parallel to the existing line. The reasons why we're building the project is to continue to provide safe, reliable service to our customers and part of that is to add redundancy to our system. So by adding a second line, uh, we add the redundancy, we eliminate single points of failure. Uh, and also, too, as you mentioned, uh, the number of customers in the Lower Mainland has grown significantly in the last few decades, so it adds additional capacity to our customers. We started this project about three years ago with the planning, the engineering. Uh, last year, we're in the procurement stage where we're ordering materials and hiring contractors. Uh, this year, we're currently in the, in the construction phase of the project. And we're actually nearing the end of construction. Uh, we hope to be completed by middle of October. And following that, uh, we'll go along the utility corridor and do cleanup and, and restoration of both the utility corridor and any properties along, along the corridor. The biggest challenge is actually working in a very congested, busy utility corridor. This urban corridor has lots of utilities like uh, electrical lines, an existing gas line, uh, water lines. We cross roads, we cross a railway, we cross uh, creeks. Uh, so just the congestion and the amount of limited space along the utility corridor is our biggest challenge. We're actually in the peak right now. We have approximately 20 active work sites along the 11 kilometer uh, project alignment, and we have approximately 300 uh, field workers uh, currently working on the project installing the gas line. Personally, it's been a very challenging, uh, interesting project. Uh, we believe this project is, is necessary for Forest BC to continue to provide safe, reliable service to our customers and I'm confident that we'll achieve that in the next few months.